guys, welcome back to Ethereal Orb. Um, today we're going to do kind of a quick will it sell video. Um, if you've been in the world of acrylic pouring for very long, you'll know that um, that's a question we have about a lot of items that we never would have thought twice about and we're buying all kinds of strange things from all different types of areas of the grocery store and the hardware store and the craft store and, and using it to create the beautiful effects that you get with acrylic pouring. So um, I'm going to, oh, I guess I am doing it in here. Let me tighten this. Remove this. Sorry about that, guys. Um, so anyway, if you watched my recent videos, you will see that um, for an early Christmas present, my mom got me some alcohol inks. And along with those alcohol inks, um, I got this alcohol blending solution. And I thought, hmm, maybe that, because it, the way it moves the alcohol, I know it's, we're complete, talking about two completely different mediums here, but my brain kind of went to acrylic pouring, and I thought, well, let's just give it a try. So this has doop -de -doop -de -doo, ethanol, glycoethers, and isopropanol. So we're just going to give it a shot. I have three colors mixed. Um, I have this Anita's Metallic lime green, uh, folk art amethyst, and Anita's um, true red. They are all mixed with Floetrol, a little bit of water, and um, the green has two drops of the alcohol blending solution, and the red and the purple have th uh, three drops. Two drops in the green, three drops in the red and the purple. So, we are just going to give it a shot here. Um, and then I have white that has nothing. It's just water, flow, trawl, and paint. And that's just um, my Blick acrylic white paint. So what I'm going to do is... Should I do one little flip cup or two little flip cups? One little, two little, three little flip cups. All right. Let's do two. Let's do... Green and red. And I know these are kind of strange colors. I kind of just grabbed them. Actually, I grabbed the purple and the green and thought, oh, those two look so pretty together and thought, I need a third color. And I grabbed the red. I'm kind of gravitating towards the red because um, I just did that challenge video. I just put that up and everybody's video had this just gorgeous red. And I loved what the red did with, of course, it was teal and, or turquoise in colors. So Anyway, I just kind of gravitated towards the red because I'm in a red kind of mood right now. All right, with all those videos. So let's do two little flip cups. I guess if I'm using all of this, I could use this as the flip cup. I was thinking there was more in it than that, and I wasn't going to want to use it all. Okay. There we go. That's okay. These cups clean up really well. The, um... Paint just peels right out of them, and I can use them again. So, oops, and the green. Not getting anything interesting going on in the cup at all. So we'll see. Okay. Flip one. And then I'm going to be a, you know what, let's do this. I don't know why I even used those, because I like these lids, baby food lids, to put these, um, this is just a canvas panel. I like putting my canvas panel on lids. Just like the way it holds them. Okay, and they're flat to the ground. Ready? Oh, these may. Oh, look, it's starting to tiny little cells, so we'll see. Okay. Oh, and we did it. Okay, so I'm going to go in with my white. Let's move these out of the way. Just pour it around there. Okay. Just checking my camera right now, and then for some reason. A little bit paranoid tonight that it's going to stop on me, and I don't know why. I have plenty of memory, plenty of battery, but 
it does happen sometimes. Maybe I'm just being too quiet, I don't know. Okay, there we go. Wipe my glove off here. We'll see what we get. Let's give it just a second. Sides are looking pretty cool. Right? Oop. Boop. And boop. Ooh, that one's pretty. Look at that one. Move it around a little bit and then I'll torch and move it around some more. Oh, that purple is gorgeous. Whoa! Oh my goodness, let's not like. This right cup is moving all over the place and that left one is not going anywhere. Okay, let's torch and then I'll move it some more. I am getting some cells. much at all. All right. Ooh, I like the bleeding. I don't want to pour all that off. Okay. I like what that right one is doing. My right, not your right. But this one, for some reason, is like I don't know, staying put. Let's try and help it along here. There we go. Ooh, look, some pretty cells with a swipe. Let's go back this way. Since we swiped, there's some pretty stuff going on there. I like that. Okay. Ooh, you know what? I really like that. Oh, look at that spot right there. That is so pretty. And I love what the swipe did. Okay. Ooh. For just kind of trying it out. That is really pretty. I love this right in here. Okay, let's torch one more time over where I swiped, maybe right in here, and see what we get. We'll see what happens where I swiped, and then we'll... Okay. There's kind of some little ones in the white. That's kind of cool, though, isn't it? I love purple. Okay, well, gosh darn. I like that, so I'm going to stop. I'll give you a close-up here. Just a second. Okay, focus. There we go. If I can keep it on in focus. Oh my goodness, look how pretty that is. <gasps> I am definitely, oh my gosh, that's gorgeous. I'm going to use that um, blending solution again and see... What we get almost looks like little gemstones, doesn't it? It almost looks bedazzled. And that's cool right in there. Love that. No real big cells, except right where the purple and the red are, but kind of magical over here looking. I don't know, I just really, really love it. Almost like foam. Hello, focus, focus. Well, there we go. No? My apologies to all of you watching the video. There we go. Just a little too close. Look at that right in there. So, so pretty. Well, there we go. Okay, I will have to do a take two on this and just see what I get the second time around. I'm really happy with it, so I do not want to play with it anymore. But there you go.
some fun things with the alcohol blending solution. I'm sorry, some of you are just, that's driving you nuts with the in and out of focus. There we go. Let me know what you think, and if you have it sitting around, maybe you've tried it in your um, fluid acrylics. Let me know what kind of results you've gotten if you've tried it. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you liked or didn't like the video, and leave a comment. I'd love to see what you guys think and have going on. And we will see you next time, guys. Happy pouring!